So I've been thinking this week about the importance of focusing on the basics. So for me, the basics are getting everything right when it comes to content creation and including promoting my social media and stuff like that. So I have a nice structure in place. I make the daily gaming news every single day. I post that on TikTok and Instagram and everywhere I post it, if you've been watching them. And then I have my Twitch stream, which I then transfer to my Play Games channel. And then in the evenings, I tend to do a cozy stream where I do a trophy farm. And for me, that gives me a lot of sense of closure. Closure seems to be the name of the game. So for example, I very recently went back and actually got the Platinum Trophy for Resident Evil 3 Remake. I've been intending to do it for a while. And now that I've done it, I feel relief. It's done. I'm finished with it. Goodbye. You know what I mean? I can let it go. And that's why I really love my to do list as well. I would highly recommend to have one if, like me, you struggle with closure. <laughs> simple as that. There are going to be some speed bumps along the way, but you know, that's life. It's as simple as that. You try to, you try your best to overcome them. And I'm really happy seeing the growth across the board. Simple as that. It is a very frustrating game content creation. It really is because, you know, it's really easy for you to get carried away with your dreams and ambitions, you know, like it's like, oh, I'm going to, you know, grow so much. I'm going to make so much money and so on. And then you see how much you're actually making. You're like, Ugh. but that's life <laughs> again as well, like I've said before. So for now, I'm focusing on the basics. I'm trying to get a structure in place, which I'm happy with. Also as well, you see me, I'm still smiling when I make the gaming news every day because I love making them. That's the main thing. So as long as I love making them, then I will keep doing it. And then there has been some questions that have come up, like why don't I get back into development, for example, software development or website development, because that's what used to be my main job before. And the reason why at the moment is simply because the amount of value of being my own boss far outweighs any potential financial gain, simple as that. So let me know how your week was.